Hi there. Now here we've got a simultaneous equation then involving at least one term that is a log. And the way that we tend to go about solving these is by the method of substitution. What I would want to do in a question like this is to get rid of this log term. Try and get it as an equation just involving x's and y's, no logs. So what I'm going to do then is turn to equation 1. So we'll just say here from 1. And using the power rule, that is I can remove this 2, I can then say that this is exactly the same as the log of y squared in base x. And that equals 1. Now I want to remove the log here. So I anti-log it and that gives me y squared equals the base which is x raised to the power 1. Well x to the power 1 is just simply x. So I'm going to call that equation 3 and I've now eliminated the log in the equation. And so I can substitute my value for x into equation 2. So I'll just put here a note, and that is to substitute equation 3 in equation 2. And doing that gives me y squared times y, in other words, y cubed, and it equals 64. So we can take the cube root then of 64, and that will give me y. So therefore, y equals the cube root of 64. And the cube root of 64 is 4. So y equals 4 then. Now that I've got y equals 4, I can substitute this back into equation 3. And doing that gives me the value of x. So therefore x equals y squared, 4 squared, which is 16. So the solution then to the simultaneous equation is x equals 16 and y equals 4. Okay?